Developing this morning, a teenager shot and killed by a plainclothes Philadelphia police officer. Yeah, now the, the cops say that these two teenagers, one of them, maybe barely a teen, fired first at them. Steve, what are you hearing? Well, Mike, uh, we're showing you City Hall, which is right down this broad street from the new Philadelphia Police Headquarters, because in five hours, we're going to get a lot more answers in the already scheduled bi-weekly Mayor's Gun Violence Press Conference. So Mayor Kenny, you can bet, has some thoughts on Philadelphia Police being shot at by somebody that we're told is between the ages of 13, maybe as young as 13, and 16, who was riding a bicycle last night at 7 o'clock in South Philadelphia while four officers in an unmarked police car in plain clothes are doing undercover surveillance for something entirely different and they see two teenagers on these two bicycles. You'll notice a 10 speed style, one on the left and then a smaller Stingray BMX style on the right. A bike that little kids ride but one of these kids had a gun out at the time and so the officers being police officers of course they're going to try to stop him and wonder why he's got a gun. And when they put the flashing lights on that unmarked car, suddenly their lives flash before their eyes because he fires a gun right through the back window of the passenger side of the car. Glass goes in the one officer's eyes. He's hurt and taken to the hospital. Uh, the bullet lodges into a headrest of one of the front seats. So it came close to killing a couple of cops. Two officers get out, both fire, hit the young man in the chest killing him as he throws the gun, which has a laser scope on it. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, that has a laser beam to help you aim exactly what you're firing at, a deadly weapon. One of the males produced a handgun and fired at least one shot into the back of this vehicle. Again, there was four officers inside of this vehicle, two officers in the front, two officers in the back. The bullet went through the passenger side rear window and um, we're very lucky, missed the officers in the back seat, and it uh, embedded in the passenger side headrest. Uh, officers exited the vehicle, fired shots at this male, chased him eastbound on the 1800 block of Barber Street. Uh, at some point, this male was struck in the chest, and um, he dropped his weapon, went down to the ground. Uh, Officers picked him up, transported him to Penn Presbyterian Hospital, where unfortunately uh, he was pronounced shortly after 7.30 p.m. Most of the family went to Penn Presbyterian. One of his aunts showed up. She could not give his date of birth and tell uh, police on the scene exactly how young he is. But we should get an identity maybe perhaps before a good day is over, just after 9 when police daily on schedule release their overnight incident report. But just an awful scene and uh, police officers never want to use their guns. Every cop I've ever met never wants to pull their gun out and they certainly don't want to shoot somebody and kill them, especially a kid. But they also don't want to have somebody shooting to try to kill them as well. Alex, Mike? For sure.